Hi everyone, I'm Heli and welcome back to my world. This is the second episode of our eco-friendly journey with Factorio and Industrial Revolution 3. In the last episode, we discussed about the plan, we look over the modes, we build a map, and we research the first technologies in order to make our assemblers and to start our factory to automate our production. To recap, we have three rules that will guide us through this gameplay. Rule one, eco-friendly, minimize the pollution with all cost. Rule two, be efficient as possible and not too slow without breaking the first rule. Rule three, stay in the radar range, respecting the first two rules. So short story, we need to decrease the pollution as fast as much as possible, then we have to increase the efficiency and like not going out or discovered area, say like this. So we cannot cross the fog war without using a radar that will discover this area. So for today, this is one of the tasks that we have. Okay, we need to research and to build some radars to increase the area to see exactly what we have around because we we'll need probably some iron and I don't know exactly where it is and even this thing it's very very few only 36,000 great remember that we are using even distribution and for each even distribution how it's working and even with this mode we are using the logistic filtration and I increase and set up these filters. We'll continue from here with a second part of filtrations and making the small mall with the mechanics from this Industrial Revolution 3. You will see it in a few minutes how this will work and how powerful it is. The transportation drones will work in a, or will help us to build our factory in city blocks. City blocks that we will uh, use them in uh, uh, covering these uh, chunks of the, of the game. Okay, so we'll not use only one chunk. We'll use uh, a city block of four chunks uh, like this. Okay, uh, here in this area we landed and we start the game. So this is the origin. So we'll start from here and we'll make the the, the grid. We'll use blueprint, uh, but I will not use uh, pre-constructed blueprints to select this. Uh, instead, I will uh, I will use only one old blueprint that is this one that will help us to deconstruct different uh, entities. And I don't want to spend more time on building that. Great, so now uh, the city block. The city blocks we need to build, uh, like I said, from the origin. I will use uh, some road. Um, road. The first road will increase the speed of 150, the second one to 200. I think I will use the second one. Uh, uh, why? I will try to explain you this is the, the recipe for the first road is coal and stone bricks, so it's pretty easy, pretty basic. If we use this road when we reconstruct, we need to recycle, no problem with that. But from me, from my point of view, I don't think it's very well balanced because the drones, transport drones, they need petroleum to, 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 to travel, okay? So you need the oil. So the second fast road, recipe okay this will be more expensive yes indeed 
but we need crude, crude oil. So crude oils and petroleum seems to be on the same uh, level. We'll use fast roads and to simplify everything. So how we'll build it? Uh, we'll build on chunks. So we cannot use this uh, sh uh, shift and space because the game is paused and I cannot do anything. It's only to preview. But we can open the debug tool and uh, show the tile grid. Okay, close this. And we'll use the road to build something like this. Okay, let's do it 4 by 4 And then we can uh, go further. Let's do it faster like this. Okay, let's copy one of these. And turn it around. Yep, that's it. Well... Good. Unfortunately, probably is not the best way to to build a blueprint since we have lots of water and uh, different obstacles in uh, in our way. But uh, let's say that this is a blueprint that will be improved in time. Let's do it. I say, I think the chunk has 64 by 64, so we need to do it like this. Let's try to find the middle of them. Yeah, I think it's okay. Five by six. Let's see if it's okay. Perfect. So now we can use this to make the entire grid. Um, as I said, the blueprint is not. Uh, Final, because this system of uh, city blocks need to have uh, power poles, need to have uh, logistic grid, so we need to transfer the, the signal from one block to another. But uh, for the moment, it's uh, enough for what we need, so we can continue to to build around this. Let's extend this a little bit on here, just like this. So this will be an intersection. Many times I like to build a, a mall. So probably I will build a mall uh, around the origin, something like this. So this part probably will be a mall, a big mall. Last time I did it uh, for in two chunks like this, but was pretty crowded. So probably we will we'll use four of them or something like this. So probably the road will not go through here. And we'll do it like this. Good, good, good. So now let's see what uh, what we are doing here with the research. Uh, all the production and all the research is stopped for the moment. Okay. Uh, but uh, let's uh, start it again. Stop for the moment, but let's start it again. So we need coal. What we are missing from here? Of course, we are missing a lot of copper. So we need to improve this. As you can see, we are already at 0 0.5 evolution. Everything is going very fast up, uh, especially because we are polluting a lot uh, and a lot it's a lot um, and about that we already researched one technology that can help us it's uh, charcoal and the uh, charcoal will reduce the pollution or fuel pollution with 50 percent so it's, this mode has a very nice interesting combination of pollution and uh, uh, production if you remember, when we use uh, ore to smelt, the recipe per pollution is at 125, so 3.75 per minute, comparing with 3. But if we are using some scrap metals, uh, the pollution is at 50% because this recipe has a recipe pollution reduction. 50 percent 
So, what if we combine the fuel pollution reduction with the recipe uh, pollution reduction? And maybe we can reach at uh, 25%. So 0 0.25, it's, it's a huge reduction. So it will help us to, to improve our, to decrease the pollution. So to make charcoal, we need 25 wood. So each wood will be transforming charcoal in 100 seconds. Okay, for that we need charcoal kill. So let's build this. At this moment here we are building these uh, uh, plates, but let's build some uh, copper gears too. Okay, we need those. And I will say that we'll increase this uh, this factory. Okay. Okay. So let's increase these productions. Make two of these two. Let's say like this. What do we need? Okay, now it's working. Now it's working. What I will do, and uh, probably I will do it uh, out of camera or on a fast forward. I will uh, try to collect more wood, and I will collect the wood from the, especially from the road. But I will be very careful not to go out of the. Um, visible area, okay, to respect the third rule. So, in order to have some uh, some uh, charcoal, I need to, to take the wood. So, let's. Okay, so I collect few wood. It's not a lot, but uh, it will be enough for us to build a couple of things. And uh, yeah, let's see how it is now. So basic three pollution per minute with a recipe of 125%, it's 3.75 pollution per minute. If I will switch this to something like this, we need to see a dis the, uh, the reduction there. Let's see even here. And um, mm -hmm. where are you? Yes. Uh, so it's only uh, 1.5. Ah, I, I think uh, we still are. are we are still burning. Uh, We are still burning uh, coal. It's 1.87 now, and in here now it's 0 0.75. Okay, 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 okay. So I mis I miscalculated. I, I was thinking that we go at 0 0.25, but 1.5 split by two, it's 0 0.75. Yeah, probably you. You saw that uh, math. And good. That that's very interesting. So yeah, we need to use this charcoal more often. Uh, even for this, uh, even for these uh, miners. Here you can see all the materials that we can burn with uh, different uh, reports and so on. So it will be very very nice. What we can do something else to decrease the pollution is for these miners, we we'll not burn the charcoal, but we'll switch this to a steam mining grid. At this moment, our source of steam is coming from the, uh, this steam uh, derrick. So we will not pollute. This is not polluting. So this will be great, but look at this. Uh, long list of items that they need to need to build 
in order to uh, to make this steam mining drill. Okay, so for that we need to we need to improve the the factory and to make more assemblers. So let's focus on this one now. Um, the city block. As I said, we need some power poles, and uh, we have the power pole like this, but we'll do it like this, like, uh, something like that. Okay, so yeah, we. Okay, in fact, I think I need more space, something like this, maybe. No snapping, but I want entities and blue. Oh, this is not helping me a lot at all. Normally this will be the system of power poles in the corners, one in the middle, and we'll make a grid, something like this. Um, like, like this, and somewhere here, we need to calculate the middle of the map, but it's something like this, I think so. Yep. Well, anyway, uh, let's see how we can uh, how can we build uh, the factory, and I promise you that I will show you how these things are working more and more. So, logistics will need to build more machines. So, in order to build more machines, let's. Uh, uh, let's have something. Oh, sorry. Okay, we need a longer one. Uh, a couple of these. Uh, how about? You building some gears, you building some gears, is everything on work? Okay, so now unfortunately we will not have of this in fact yes we just need to do something like this they will stick between this 
This is what the trees are dragging now, and this is what we are polluting. So let's connect somehow this. This minor. about this we are mining we are mining uh, coal that we are hoping that we will not use anymore for a long time look at this now we have a second one but to have this one we need to make all of this Work hard, help hard, yes. What else? Let's find this one. And this one so, the pollution. Pollution. Okay, so now we can see the difference. The recipe pollution is 125%, fuel pollution 50%. So the pollution is at 1.87 that's that's great man. that's absolutely great so we have lots of copper so we're missing this one so we need to build more machines like this okay so what are the most common items that we need Copper roads. We need copper pivot. So, copper roads. So let's see um, the logistics. Maybe we can build these ones now. Yes. Absolutely great. with this research then we'll have to make some crushers the crushers will change the recipes so that would be great and this will go to the bronze age our purpose is to make sustainable wood so we'll go to this direction as fast as possible second we need a radar that early radar is bronze telescope it's a very nice graphic and um, I don't know how it is for you but I really like even this sound of uh, steampunk uh, all these machines that are making these noises yeah okay we have another one so now we can make even more parts lots of uh, a small one no it's not working a small one give me one more piece one of stuff of that give me one more piece 
and this started. Haha, <laughs> this is great. So now we are already fighting a lot uh, against the pollution, and we are still having a couple of uh, uh, alcohol, but we are already lacking them. Let's cut more trees. Maybe from here there are lots of them. Two more. I promise we'll replant this uh, these trees. I promise that. As you can see, pollution is huge. So let's uh, let's take a look on the statistics. So at one minute we have something like this. So we decrease the pollution a lot. So in one hour, early meal, my mining drills, the burner mining drills, polluting a lot. So we can see here that if we use steam, we will not pollute anymore. So we have one more that is here and there, but they're not working. Ah, we have the logistics. So, the logistics, the beautiful logistics. We'll use this delivery plate, okay? Two dimensions, 2 by 2 3 by 3 uh, We'll use the 3 by 3 because it's pretty large. So what this is doing? Well, you put it down here when it crawls. They will take everything from the um, chest. But to do that, or to work like that, we need to do something like this. Uh, we need to dedicate a couple of uh, say this, uh, spots or a couple of uh, how, how do they call it? Storage areas. Okay, storage areas in our inventories for these items. So we need this, maybe we need this, maybe for more of this, something like this. Uh, we can dedicate one of these for these two. So let's see how these things are gonna go, how they will work. Ooh, lots of them. Uh, let's see this. Can we make, oh, yes, 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 I like it. I like it. More. Okay, so how these are working? Okay, so the logistics are saying like this. Okay, I don't need any copper plates in my inventory, but I will dedicate this slot for copper plates. So when I'm pressing C, uh, uh, Shift and C for even distribution, they will push everything I have in inventory regarding the logistics rules to machines, okay? So if I don't need any copper plates, they will push the copper plates to all the machines until I have zero. What this reservation is doing is saying that, okay, uh, is saying to this plate that I need one slot of copper analysis pack one slot of tin plate and so on. So when I will cross this one, they will transfer the items to me. Look, bang, to the search pack. For that, we need to have chests and inserters. The crushing is going on. Okay, I really want to have the robots very soon yeah the early robots the couple robots they will help us to construct everything uh, what else I need a car some monowheel yes okay that's it great so now uh, we have these two let's do it like this one one let's build them no is wrong 
that's the copper boiler sorry okay another small assembler okay lots of rods i don't need the rods anymore i need these plates great so now we have the gears um, let's say like this the gears are here okay so is it question the gears i'm pressing C, uh, shift and c to push them into machines see everything is going on if i'm staying on this plate i'm playing, pressing shift c and distributing the, the items to the machines and in the same time i'm taking the uh, the materials that i need great so these are working we still have fuel okay we still have a couple of it but we'll not have enough for what we need to do here So probably I will not take any more uh, ores to smelt because I have lots of copper. So we, I have some tin. So before to make that tin, I need to uh, make it uh, again as I need to mine it with uh, steam mining drills. I will use this. Pipes, any more pipes? Okay, so, as I said, lots of lots of pipes. Lots of lots of lots of pipes. Okay, how is with uh, with the steam? Uh, it's working? Yes, since it's working, uh, probably we need to make even some um, storages. Uh, I don't remember exactly where are they. Oh, here they are. Small steam tank. Okay. Thanks for storing the uh, what I wanna do, I want to make a small logic into something like this. I'll get, it, get crazy. I don't want to lose any more steam. So when I will uh, deconstruct some machines or some uh, part of the factory, I will unlock this or I will uh, switch these uh, underground pipes to decrease the steam from the pipes at this moment i'm mining the steam put them in the tanks and not lose any more time but look at this look at this that's how beautiful it is so do we have these ones uh, yeah. okay so now because it's enough room i can deconstruct this no problem at this moment. Uh, oh, okay. We have some small problem. We'll automate everything in very, very few minutes. Just give me a second to make this work. So now we have Steam 2, right? Tell me that you're working. Yes, you're working. Perfectly. So now going back to the pollution, looking again. Okay, let's see. Okay. So we still have some pollution generated by uh, burner mining drills and the uh, steam mining drills. Oh, so the steam mining drills are still polluting? Oh, I wasn't expecting that. So, I 
was thinking that I'm reducing the pollution. Well, if they are polluting, we don't have anything. So it's out of our control. Great, great, great. So now let's uh, let's see the the research. The research is going okay. Uh, we still have enough time to build this one, so let's try to make more machines. So how we want to kind of, how we want to build this? So this one will have something like this, and uh, the chest will be like this. So this is the this is the limit. No one more. So these are extracting from, ah, like guess. Okay, good. So this is the this is the maximum limit. Okay, so this plate, if I'm crossing this plate, will take from all the chests in this area. Okay. So now I will gonna build a blueprint with this uh, with this uh, delivery plate. have a blueprint very complex blueprint it was a little difficult until I uh, to, to understand exactly how can I make this and after I I, I figured out that I need to build the first a corner and then to flip it and then to copy it again flip it unfortunately this uh, blueprint uh, with the pipes uh, as in, you know in factory you cannot flip it so switch it and so on so you can only rotate it but i think it's i think it's okay so let's uh, let's put it uh, around somewhere 
do this somewhere here. Yep. Yep. It's okay. Uh, last time, I think I was able to. Uh, well, I think it was better to put it a little down. Let's move it down. Let's do it something like this. Yes, let's do it something like this. Okay. As I said I don't want to lose any more. Uh, no, no steam. So let's do something this fast. Okay. And. Okay, main, meanwhile we researched the, the bronze tool and we have another research that is finished and it's the crushing machine. So the crushing machine as I said they will it will change the way as we are processing the ore. So now we just need to build something different. Uh, I don't know why I did construct those. We need those. <laughs> I will put them back. Uh, so let's see where we can. Because this, this uh, steam will go through. This machine from one to another. Okay, we have the crusher now. So we need to build somehow. It's like this. The crusher will use steam to crush the ore and to result of crushed tin ore. Okay, you put tin ore, you have crushed tin ore one to one in two seconds. The advantage is that comparing with the tin that you make it in a thinning goat in stone furnace or in the furnace and you have pollution at 125% now because you have crashed in ore the pollution is at 100% so it decreases already with 25% and it will result in one two or two thin ingots so 1.5 per one thin ore that's a good improvement it's a great improvement so now we need to crush all the ore before put them in the, in the ingots the idea with this mall is that here we will build all these small parts and big parts in order to make the factory and to increase and to colonize this planet and so on we will need the ores the ingots somewhere near us because we'll make, make another uh, let's say uh, something like this a plate and probably we'll make some uh, uh, where's the limit here's the limit okay so we'll make something like here where each chest like this will have one type of uh, ingot we'll use this ingot to to take these ingots in our inventory and uh, uh, distribute them to our machines and then take the parts from this plate and use them further to increase the factory okay so let's start to make some automation yeah what about this automation <laughs> one two Three, four, five. I want to make a system here. 
what are we building? Build this, build this, and you build this. Let's see, can I make this? Crusher, 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 crusher. Uh, the crusher will be like this. It will receive some a chest. Give me oh. build a couple pistons we need the pistons for insectors how it is so in one what else this one let's say this i don't think i need so many plates of uh, tin But maybe I will need this, and I will need this, and some ingots. So now everything is coming to me, and I'm sending directly to production. Look at this, how fast it is now. Oh, I did a burning shelter. Well, that's bad, but not so problematic. We still have charcoal, 50 charcoal. We see if it's enough. This research is pretty slow. Can we make another steam laboratory? Wood. Okay, we need wood. For that we need wood. Now these are semi automated. Let's try to take this wood and make another research. Ooh. Just one second. Because we have the pistol. Okay. Not such a big difference. You must to make the plate. Oh, you did enough of the those things. I forgot about this one. Good. Uh, how about you? Plate. Make plates, please. Lots, lots of plates. Then I move here, then I move here, then I move here. Oof. So much. Or so many to build. And how is it with the pollution? Wow. Pollution. Yeah, well, it seems. Yes, so it seems even if using steam, he is generating pollution. So that's not normal. I think the mode has a couple of things that are not very well balanced, but in total, I think it's a very nice mode and it's working very nice one what we are intending to do how is with the steam the steam is uh, dropping yeah because we are not generating anymore new steam good uh, we we have one yes we have another one 
Let's take all of them and split them between three, these three laboratories. Can we make another one? Yes, we can. And we we'll need more wood. Crash call 75%. Okay, crash call can be made in a crusher. Okay, let's see that somehow. Okay, let's make that. Then we need to make another steam miner. Woof, 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 woof. Faster, faster. Faster, please. Reduce the consumption. You can still keep this here. But... Use the consumption of the steam. No? I'm uh, trying to save the movements of the that inserter. Three on three hundred. So I was planning to have this uh, telescope to have the radar and to push the boundaries was not so fast the research was not so fast i was as i was expecting or i don't know i was hoping that's, yeah it's better like this but at least we push on with the factories with the assemblers we have kind of production say like this uh, give me one of these oh man that's so slow there's so many parts to build I'm complaining with this uh, mod and people are play are playing uh, Pyanodons with hundreds thousands of parts <laughs> That's late for me. Okay, so we can crash this. Yes. Yes, that's good. That's very, very good. What else? Mm, okay, we have the plate. So now when I'm crossing this plate, everything what that will be in these uh, storages or chests will move to my inventory. But in order to have this, we'll need to build these one, two, three, four machines and many, many others. Okay, 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 enough pistons. 83 pistons damn well, but now i need this one i need wood beams let's make wood beams can you burn what wood beams wood beams yes they have one megajoule two megajoules so you take one okay and you give two yes so you split inside the energy. I think we are consuming a lot of steam, right? 592. Yeah, 592. don't have enough we 
have too many rods. Okay, we have too many rods of this. We don't have any more ingots. Okay, so we need to increase this uh, this part to automate the smelting and to push it even further, faster. So this is not enough. This is not enough for what we need. Four, five. Should we build another one? Well, I, th I think the research now is going on. I think we need to um, concentrate on um, on chain production. Maybe we need to put these ores on belts. Okay, so the glass is done. Oh, it's a interesting process. Silica, silica is made from uh, gravel. Gravel is made from stone. So we need crusher, crusher, uh, alloy furnace, and we will have glass. In the same times, we can have bronze now. Okay. We can have bronze, and with bronze, we'll, uh, we'll start to make some bronze forestries. But all of this, until on the next episode, in uh, two days. If you like what you see until now, please give me a like, subscribe, and see you next time. Bye.